And now you're studying at the Sir Alexander Gibson Opera School in Glasgow. That must be tremendously exciting. Oh, it is a lot of fun. And I sort of pinch myself quite regularly that I'm there, seeing that only three years ago I'd graduated from uh, from York, and then I did a year with the National Youth Choir Fellowship, and I got a place at um, Royal Conservatory of Scotland to go and do a two-year Master of Music in Performance. And I arrived there in September 2018, and within about five weeks, I said to my teacher, I think I want to audition for the opera school. What do you think? And she said, I was about to say the same thing to you. And so I went, (laughs) I had about three weeks to prepare, and in I went and thought, well, it'll be what it'll be. And I got a place. And so I started there September 2019. And this has just been the most thrilling, wonderful whirlwind ride so far. I've got another year left and it is a amazing, tiring, but inspiring experience. Tell us about the range of roles that you've been able to try out and which best suit your voice. So in this um, year just gone, 2019 to 20, I have done in scenes the role of Hansel in Hansel and Gretel by Humperdinck and Octavian in Der Rosenkavalier by Strauss. Um, and then I was Jenny in Kurt Vile's Die Dreigroschen Oper. And if the lockdown hadn't happened, I would have been playing Memory in Poulant's um, Dialogue of the Carmelites. So very sad not to have been performing that amazing role. But um, it's... Yeah, it's really interesting sort of working out what roles I love and where I can see myself going. I particularly see myself playing trouser roles, so playing playing men. I've got the stature for it, I've got the voice for it, but a voice that really enjoys it. And I find it very interesting to do those sorts of roles. So hopefully I'll be doing things like Carabino quite soon, fingers crossed. Disc four, please. Disc four is... The Gloria from Bach's Lutheran Mass in F, which is a little bit obscure, but is the most incredible. I think it's one of the best Glorias I've ever heard from from a work. I sang it for the first time at York in my third year with the 24, which is the chamber choir there. And the first time I sang it, I just suddenly had this big rush of endorphins and I was buzzing with excitement and happiness after singing it which is one of the first times that I'd sort of had that major, major rush. And it's very quick, very fast coloratura with amazing Baroque horns. And it's, um, if, I, if I'm feeling down or if I'm just feeling a bit lethargic, I put on this Gloria and instantly I feel brighter. I feel ready to go. And it's just, it's just a masterpiece. Bach is a master and this is a really brilliant example of his work.